this is the Iron Man PSVR demo and we're gonna jump right into the demo I'm not gonna be doing too much talking as I want you to see what this demo has to offer the game comes out in July I'm very excited for it I, before I start I did want to point out that in this game you actually have arms which is pretty cool considering you're only using the move controller um, most games cut you off at the wrist so you can't really you know get too much immersion but this is fun you actually have a body too you can kind of see it uh, so we're gonna go ahead and start the demo up I'm probably not gonna be saying too much I'll jump in here or there with some commentary um, but here's the demo Okay, Arc 3 test flight. Starting with maneuvering thrusters. Hands by my sides. Palms back. <laughs> good. Feels good. All right. Time to open her up. Okay, I know I said I wouldn't talk too much, but I definitely should give some sort of... Uh commentary on so far I mean the controls are fun and the suit actually makes noises so that's cool um, right now we're just flying to the beginning where you're gonna see all these hold on let me get past you see all these mountains here you're gonna be doing uh, like a, a flight test so we're gonna be flying through those mountains over there and uh, yes yeah, so I'll let you go ahead and check that out opening targeting suite Pulsers ready. Hands up, palms forward. All right. Bullseye. You may have a problem, Tony. Pepper, I have a lot of problems. I'm serious. You and this armor. Do I need to stage an intervention? Only if I start wearing it to bed. Where are you, anyway? Look out the window. Oh, hi, handsome. Looks like you made some upgrades. The, the aim on this is surprisingly easy. I was kind of worried that it was going to be very difficult. Two more targets left. But it's not at all. It, it has a sort of a uh, targeting system for you. One more. The turning I'm getting used to because you actually have to press a button to uh, like snap 45 degrees, I think. That's how it's done. What's next? I Time wish it had smooth turning, but I went. Oh, you to... know I work better with an audience. I went to the options menu, but. There wasn't an option for smooth turning. Maybe they might include it, but I imagine that would that would cause a lot of uh, motion sickness. So they probably won't. Let's start with boost. <laughs> that was wow. I think if I swap the DC motor for a solar power converter and apply quarter inch magnetic articulation seals to the boot thrusters, I can reduce yeah. my drag coefficient by 10, maybe 10.5 percent. Oh, okay. Should I be writing this down? No need. I've got a mind like a steel trap. Oh, yeah? When's my birthday? Uh, sorry, Pepper, you're cutting out. Sounds like you need to reduce your BS output. No, that one's within the normal range. The jets. I want to punch something. Okay. So now we got this little rocket punch, which is pretty cool, in my opinion. This rocket's engaged. Time to throw a punch. 
Knockout! <laughs> Just like Happy Hogan Tom. Oh. Great aim. Time to punch out. Well done, Tony. Did you get what you needed? Or are you going to go again? No, I'm I'm through. Maybe later after I noodle on it some more. Sounds great. Meet me back here when you're ready. The wrist aren't supposed to have been like that. Strange. All right. This is pretty cool. You're in your little private jet. You can pick stuff up. It's actually a pretty detailed, uh, oops, give it back. There we go. It's actually a pretty detailed tablet. I mean, for the, you see the little USB ports and everything, and the, they did a good job. A little microphone. So we're going to open up this. Can I? Interact with it at all? No? That's all right. Morning, sir. May I get you something? Friday. Have you seen Pepper? I believe she's putting out a fire. Literal or figurative? She's been on the phone with the press all morning. Something about your surprise announcement caused quite a stir. Or don't you watch the news? Tony Stark, no stranger to stunning revelations, shocked the business world today when he named Pepper Potts the new CEO of Stark Industries. During a press conference, Mr. Stark admitted he had not informed Ms. Potts of his decision prior to the announcement. Perhaps you jumped the gun, sir. It's the opportunity of a lifetime. She's going to thank me. I'm going to kill you. The company turned a corner years ago. We're a force for good in this world. And I want you to get that message out there. Don't people always try to shoot the messenger? No. <laughs> Friday, who taught you how to fly? Uh, you did, sir. Unfortunately, I'm not in control right now. Someone has taken us over. Remotely. Out there! It's a Stark drone! Combat drone? We don't make combat drones anymore. The drone is encasing itself in some sort of hard light shield. Hello, Stark. Do I know you? I'm just a ghost from your past. Tony, look! Incoming! That's my suit. Tony! Friday, your airline just lost my luggage. Then file a complaint when we land. Override my safety belt. Pepper, I... I know. Just come back in one piece. Where's my head at? In the crowds as usual, sir. 
That ground's getting awfully close. Heads up. Doesn't look like it. All systems online. Just in time. I got a plane to catch. You cannot run your past, Stark. We'll see about that. <laughs> Can you hear me? A little windy, but yeah, I hear you. Sir, we have a massive breach in the hull. Old news, Friday. Tell me about something I didn't just jump out of. Scanning. There's an engine fire that needs your attention. <laughs> Secondary explosion on the right engine, sir. Got it. Fire suppression system online. That's one less burning issue to deal with. Good job, sir. Pilot is no longer responding, and the jet is projected to crash into a populated area. I'll deal with the autopilot. Pepper? No, stay put. It's too dangerous. Says the guy who jumped out of the plane. Any more from our mystery guest? They're giving us the silent treatment, but their hounds are clawing at the door. Show them in. Bolza! for Miss Potts. This is not great in firewall. Our new friend's messing with my HUD. They've also locked me out of the jet's diagnostics. I have no read on Miss Potts. Pepper, do you copy? Enemies inbound. Pepper! Pepper, come in! Pepper! You okay in there? Tony! I have control of the jet! Keep the good news coming! Sir, more hostiles en route. Friday, what did I just say? to know that. Uh, guys! I can't steer! Sir, the aileron on the left side has been damaged. Is that fixable? I'll have to wing it. Strip 
for emergency landing. Thanks, Friday. Pepper, you think you can land this bird? Only one way to find out. Lowering the landing gear. <laughs> the landing gear doors are malfunctioning. Of course they are. Pepper. Gear is down. Three green. Well done, both of you. If no one has any further objections, I say we call it a day. Your old weapons will be the death of you. Sir, I'm detecting a new energy signature. More enemies? Good. My trigger finger's getting itchy. Attack, sir. Armor has sustained damage, sir. Yeah. We'll need repairs when we get back to the garage. Below optimal, but not critical. Seat health is below critical threshold. All threats neutralized, but I'm sensing our hacker friend has returned. <laughs> Friday? Friday? All systems are down. The big one's back. My controls are locked! It's vanished from radar. I can see that. Get me back online. Systems restored. Tony, nothing's responding here. Sir, I believe the jet is officially a lost cause. Pepper, find an exit. Right. You're connecting flight. Next time, I want my own suit. I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, press the like button, subscribe for future updates and future releases. Y'all have a great rest of your day.